Alright, welcome back to part 8 in what should be the conclusion of the Deep Blooper C map of the story mode. I have to press this stupid torpedo button. I'll take blue because green is taken. And unfortunately, I land on this question mark space, so I have no chance at getting that next star. And Wario lands on it as well, but in a different place, I think. Peach is passing by the boo. Chooses to steal coins from Mario. Would probably make more sense to steal them from Mario because he has more coins, but I guess Mario has helped out Peach enough that it just makes more sense to not go against Mario since he's in fourth too. team up in this mini game but I don't like Mario anymore like I did in the last map he's just too evil now okay I find it's a lot more difficult to be the person placing the log in this mini game Even so, though, we should still win this easily. Finish! And Mario can get some more coins. I mean, I wanted to get revenge on Mario for not letting me get that first star, but based on how this is going, there's really no need to go after Mario. I mean, he's never even going to have a star to steal. And I won't be able to get to Boo to actually steal a star because there aren't really enough turns left. I guess I don't want to go that way, that would just land me on Bowser. I guess I have no choice, but... Well, actually, I... Yeah, I will go that way, but hopefully it doesn't make me use the key. Yeah, that's actually a much better move. To land on that question mark block by not using the skeleton key. That bank is up to 35 coins. It's beginning to look like nobody's ever going to actually get the money that's in the bank, but it's serving its purpose anyway. Peach is launched back over there where she has the chance, chance to use Boo again to steal some stuff. Lucky I still have my Boo repellent. Hopefully she doesn't make a smart move and get rid of the Boo repellent and then get somebody to steal from me again later.
All right, we should have this. Of course, right after I said that, they got dangerously close, but we still won. Uh, the teams in this game get always just argue over who's the best. Now I'm up to 86 coins. In a really good position if I could actually get over somewhere and use the coins. And Mario gets two items. Yes, it's only fair he is in last place. Okay, yeah, I don't have any need to use any of my items, but where am I going? Guess my options are basically to go up and get the star for myself, or go to the side and steal somebody else's star. Okay, never mind. Of course I get it too, so I don't get to do either of those. Because if the odds are only 20% that something bad is going to happen, it will. Oh god, a chance time. Those are the worst. Especially this late in the game. Well, let's just see what happens, I guess. His prize is 30 coins. Someone will be giving to Mario, and it will be Wario giving coins to Mario, so... He doesn't have 30 coins. But he will give the 16 he does. So I guess that was nice of him. As long as he's not making me give away my stars, I should be okay. Hopefully Peach doesn't steal from me, or this would be really terrible. And she did. That's... that's... oh god. Now Mario is right there, and he can steal my star because he can afford it. I'm probably going to wind up with zero stars in the end now. it was Peach's plan to try to help Mario win after Mario helped Peach. I'm really not liking the look of this though, especially since I only got a two so I won't be able to get a star back. This minigame is kind of hard to control. Okay, somebody's doing something crazy somewhere. I just can't look at anybody else's screen because I'm busy with mine. Okay, yeah, I did not mean to do that. Peach is definitely a lot smarter than right? whatever this game is supposed to be about. Okay, so what is it supposed to be the first to 100 points? I didn't know anything like that. Either I didn't read through the instructions clearly or the instructions are really bad and don't actually explain it. 
And here comes Mario along to Boo. Using a gold mushroom to get there. And what is his decision? Stealing coins? Really? Okay. I can live with that. Could have sworn he was gonna be smart enough to just steal the star from me. I mean, now he has a ton of coins, but no star, so... He's basically just an idiot. Unless he gets blown back that way again and gets to steal a star then. Which he probably will, because... You know, the computers always get lucky with whatever they want to. For some reason though, he chooses not to go that way. So he's even more of an idiot than I thought. And I just get a two and land on another stupid item game. I don't know why I can never get good dice rolls. I mean, I did once when I used a golden mushroom and moved like 20 spaces, but... Apart from that... Not much has been going my way. Okay, I wasn't aiming for that item, but I guess it's a pretty good one. go for the chance time, so another one of these that can just change the game completely out of nowhere. Especially in the last few turns, which it's even later than the last one. Oh god, okay Mario's giving something away so I don't have to worry right off the bat. 30 coins to Wario. Kind of funny, I'm pretty sure the exact opposite thing happened last time. Except Wario didn't actually have the 30 coins to get to Mario. She's still 50 coins behind. Of course, with Wario getting those 30 coins from chance time, he could make a comeback. And actually, it's the last turn, so that item I picked up will be completely useless. 
We're doing a battle for 20 coins, so if Wario wins this, we're in a lot of trouble here. Actually, if pretty much anyone wins this except me. Or maybe Mario, but um, of course I think this is a luck-based game. So of course the last dual mini game that will pretty much decide the whole game is a luck based game. And Wario took green so I have to take red I guess. And Mario is out first. He's pretty much the only one I could accept winning this except me. And Wario stole green again. Why doesn't he let Luigi have it? And there I go, so basically I've lost this one. Unless I win a bonus star. At least one, because somebody else will probably win one too. Alright, so Peach won it. Basically, all comes down to bonus stars. I finished third and I'm the only one that doesn't get any coins out of it. Somehow that doesn't seem entirely fair. Since it's the last turn, I might as well use this poison mushroom on Peach because I don't really have anything else to use it for. And finally now on the last turn where it doesn't even matter, I get it. I roll and it lands me on Game Guy of all places on the last turn. God, this game. I'm gonna have to go for the big one. I'm half thinking it'll be the little one at this point. And now the big one still looks like he's doing fine. Yes! So after like three tries, I finally win the Game Guy minigame. That should put me back in first for coins. And that might actually help me get the bonus star as well for it. So for once, Game Guy actually helps me out. And that might be enough to get me to win. Kidding me? Peach just gets a hidden block that contains a star on the last turn. That is absolutely ridiculous. I better get at least two bonus stars now. That is unbelievable. On top of that, I have to team up with Peach in the next game. And Peach is acting like a complete moron that doesn't know how to play it. I mean, really, it doesn't matter who wins this mini game, but with the way Peach is playing it, we're certainly not. Good God, Peach. Unbelievable how bad she is at this. 
Anyway, like I was saying, it wouldn't matter if we won anyway, because it's just basically me and Peach going for the final, and that way would just give us ten more coins, both of us, for the mini game star, so it wouldn't give me any progress at all. Still can't believe Peach just stole a star on the last turn of the game out of nowhere. Well, she didn't really steal it, it just came out of nowhere. Final number of coins, Luigi is easily the best. The mini game star, I have. I usually get this one, so hopefully. Oh my god, I didn't. I am screwed. I got the I got the second bonus star, but Peach got a bonus star. Oh wait, this one goes to Mario, Luigi, and Wario, so everybody except Peach got that one, so I think I should be able to still win. I didn't even think I landed on that many question mark spaces in this game. I thought I had a lot better of a chance of winning for mini games than I did for question mark spaces, but apparently that was the thing that got me the win. That really came down to the wire at the end there. Finished with a win just based on the coins I got from Game Guy. If I didn't, if Peach didn't find that random star on the last turn, I wouldn't have needed the coins from Game Guy. Only got a B rank in this level, but I'll save with it. Oh, uh, we've apparently earned the kindness star stamp. But Yoshi comes out of nowhere. Apparently Yoshi thinks he's the kindest one ever. For some reason. Really, I think if you're arguing over how kind you are, then you're not really that kind. A duel must decide it. Clearly, whoever wins in a head-to-head -head duel will prove who is the kindest. Because that just makes as much sense as doing a regular party in the first place for it, but... Anyway, that will be the end of what I believe is part 8, and the end of this recording session, so I'll do the duel map in the next parts.